Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. It is Sunday, which means it is Subscriber Sundays. It is my favorite time of the week because I get to show off the amazing and incredible levels that you guys send in. For a chance to be featured, all you have to do is leave a comment down below and make sure you're subscribed. First of all, I want to say I apologize for all the kind of bland content I've been posting over the past few weeks. I've been very, very busy with some real life stuff, but I, everything should be good now and I should have more time to work on some more creative videos. So thank you to everyone that stuck around during this kind of low point. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started with The Lava Rush by Mr. Popo CEO. Please avoid the rising prego. Uncleared level with 39 attempts. Alright, let's do it. Is this a refresher? Probably not. <laughs> I'm always a bit suspicious when a level starts with that. Oh, right. Rising lava level. Okay, we should be fine. Actually, this looks kind of tough. This genuinely feels like it might be a challenge. Oh gosh, that lava is getting really, really close. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Okay, let's not mess this up. Let's do a little baby jump there. There we go. All right, we're still good. We're still kind Oh gosh, I didn't want to do that. I don't feel good about this run anymore. I'll get the 30, why not? Oh my gosh. Hang on, we're still okay, we're still okay. No, we're not okay. Yeah. I kind of felt like that was going to happen. I kind of stumbled and fumbled. And it did not feel like a good run. But this is a pretty cool level. Alright, this already feels a little bit better. So that's good. That, never mind, I ruined it. I ruined it, didn't I? I heckin' ruined it. Maybe... Let's find out, let's find out. This doesn't... I don't feel good about this. We're, we're holding on. We're barely holding on. Oh, this is tense. Get up there, get up there. Okay, the, the star isn't gonna help me from the lava. Okay. <laughs> we're good. <laughs> And we're good. Nice! Okay. <laughs> oh, that level was fun. That was actually kind of exhilarating. I didn't think I was going to make it. But we found a way, we persevered, and we did it. That was really fun. Nice diversity when it came down to the obstacles. I like the flow of it. Really, really cool level. Oh, that was fun. All right, thank you so much for sending it in. Let's keep it going. All right, next up we have a Blue Barrage by Ninja101. Hard Kaizu, one checkpoint, a little blue. What the heck is this? <laughs> Only one clear, and that one clear has a 50 minute world record on it. Okay, I'm ready. I'm, I'm not gonna think about the world record time. I'm just gonna do my thing. Okay, so do a little jump there. Do a baby jump. <laughs> This is cool. Also, I should point out that the creator left me a message stating that there was a soft lock somewhere. So we're going to have to be on the lookout for that. Hopefully it's not too intrusive. And it won't hinder us too badly. There we go. That is a little bit of a tight jump. Oh, this whole level is filled with tight jumps. That's okay. I love a good challenge, right? I love a good challenge. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta go. Nice. Okay, we're, we're okay. Wait. I, I'm, a, I'm a little bit confused as to what I'm supposed to do there. Am I supposed to ditch the dry bones shell? Or am I supposed to jump on the thwomp on the left hand side? I'm a little unsure. Maybe? Or maybe I do jump on the thwomp, get an extra bounce, 
And then from there, we can use that extra bounce to get on top of the platform on the right hand side. That's kind of what I'm leaning towards. I don't think I'm supposed to keep my dry bones shell. I think that's where I'm confusing myself. Because I think that's just a reclaimer. I think I'm supposed to do that. That makes a lot more sense. So, <laughs> okay, I just spent like six and a half minutes on that part. I thought I was supposed to keep the dry bone shell. It wasn't until I noticed the spring setup beneath the boo that I realized that I don't think I'm doing it right. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. I'm here now. There we go. Huh. This is tricky. This is a tricky little level. There we go. Nice. Perfect. I'm just following indicators at this point. Ooh, that was kind of saucy. Wait, what's this? Bonus room. Nice. Okay, into the subworld we go. Oh, and judging by the world record, this is where things get tough, right? This is where things are going to be taken up a notch. Something like that. <laughs> that was pretty good progress, I think. You know, despite the fact that we lost the, the thickness. Oh, that's, that's tough. Thank you. I don't think... Hmm. Actually, I think I do know how to do that part. I think I need to go slower. Just follow the coin trail, I think. Oh my gosh, this jump is so tight. There we go. So, okay. <laughs> Alright, slowly but surely, we're making progress with this level. Nice. Nice. Oh, that was a really... Oh no, why'd you go that way? Why did you go that way? I thought we were fine. I thought we were good. I was getting ahead of myself. <laughs> huh? Wait, how did that happen? How did the, the bob bomb get crushed like that? I don't think I've seen that. <laughs> oh, I see how that's happening. I'm going too slow. I guess technically the bob bomb is like going through the blocks because it came off a rail. There we go. That works better. Just got to be a little bit faster. Dang it. All right. Let's assume we're thick. We crush this land here. This looks hard. <laughs> I think this is one of the sections that's actually a lot easier with the thick mushroom. So maybe it won't be as bad as it seems right now. Thank you. <laughs> Okay. Does this, is this going to kill both munchers? It isn't. Oh, we're still good, though. We're still heckin' good. Oh, now we're not good. Wait, this is so tough. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? The jumps just keep getting tighter and tighter. I can see why the world record is what it is now. I can see. Oh my gosh, hang on, we're good. Two things. First of all, I somehow did a near pixel perfect jump and landed between both snowballs. Second of all, wasn't there supposed to be a second snowball coming from the bottom being shot out of a cannon? I didn't see it that time around, unless I went too slow? But I don't think so, I just don't think it fired. Okay, I think we're doing the thing now. Okay, we're good. Oh, phew. Made it through. We are not done, are we? No shot. I think I found the soft lock. <laughs> I found the soft lock, guys. 
Oh, that's unfortunate. That's a tight little choke room at the end. Alright, let's run it back, guys. Let's run it back. No worries. It happens. It happens. I'm not upset with the map creator, don't worry. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> this... It's it's tricky. It's very tricky. Oh, this is another soft lock. Wait, this is not good. <laughs> I got soft locked again. That's okay. That is that is okay. Do it. <laughs> Please, let's do it. Are you serious, dude? Are you serious? Was that a was that about to be a one shot of the entire level? Oh, I'm definitely gonna bait you guys really hard with that one. <laughs> that is so anticlimactic. Okay. What is it? Fourth time's the charm? Oh, fourth time is the charm. Oh wow, that was a that was a doozy. It actually wasn't as difficult the third time around doing the entire course. Took a little bit of time to figure it out, but the level itself, once you know the optimal path, it's actually pretty nice and flows very well. Some of the jumps were a little bit tight, but that just adds to the challenge in my opinion. It didn't really take away from the experience. I never found myself frustrated or anything. Really cool level, and look at that, we kind of destroyed that world record, so we'll take it. Thank you so much for sending it in, had a ton of fun, let's keep going. Alright, next up we have 1-3 Muncher Zone by Mirko DDD. No description. Alright, let's do it. Looks like this is part of a super world, but definitely doesn't look like a traditional kind of world. Or maybe it is, hang on. We're good. There's like a Z indicator there. There's also a coin indicator taking me down here. Oh, that was kind of spooky. Uh, yeah, I'll just do it this way. Nice. Wait. Ugh. Where am I to go from here now? I don't think I'm supposed to send it. Am I? No, surely not. Let me just get up here again. I might just send it. Sending it is definitely never a bad thing. First I need to get up there. Toad! Thank you. Okay, I'm sending it. Nothing. <laughs> Look at all those people that sent it as well. Okay, they probably have something to do with this arrow here. Maybe I need to shoot a fire flower in there? <laughs> I don't think this does anything. I thought maybe it would. What am I to do then? If I'm not sending it. I didn't do anything. What happens if I go this way? Oh, wait. Wait, wait. No. Look, there's like a little pathway in there. There's a seesaw there too. Oh, I see what I'm doing. I see what I'm doing. I'm supposed to damage, right? Stand right here. Yep. Okay. 
There goes the pal. So that's how that works. That's actually really cool. But I need to keep my mushroom. Or a, the fire flower, I guess, would make more sense. And that's how we get there. Okay. This makes more sense. Oh, it is progressive. Dang it. I was hoping it wasn't. Ah, we should still be okay, though. We still got the, the mushroom. That's the most important part. So now we can move on with the level. Don't get hurt there. Okay. Oh, that's not good. I feel like I needed to keep my mushroom. That's just kind of the vibe I'm getting from this. What do you shoot? Oh, you shoot a bullet. Okay, nice. Made it through. Oh, we're done, Zo. Okay, I wasn't punished. I thought I needed to keep that, uh, that mushroom. But luckily, that was not the case. Phew! That was a fun little puzzle, I'm not gonna lie. That was pretty fun. I enjoyed that heavily. Kinda wish it was a little bit longer, but that's not a bad thing, I don't think. And it looks like this is part of a super world, so it looks like if I wanted more of these kinds of puzzles, I would just go ahead and check out your super world. Thank you so much for sending that in. I had a lot of fun. Really cool puzzle. Let's keep going. All right, next up we have Monty Hideaway by Sailor Montu. The Monty police try to get you, but can you get to their King Monty boss? Uncleared level 158 attempts. All right, let's do it. I, I picked this level because it is uncleared, and out of the uncleared levels that Sailor Mon 2 has, this one had the most amount of attempts, so this one might be the most challenging one. I'm always up for a good challenge, so here we are. Wait. Okay, I don't think that question mark block has anything. I don't know why I'm so fixated on it. I'm just gonna move on and go about my life without it. I did the same exact thing. I did the same exact thing. <laughs> okay. Stuff's happening. <laughs> I, I'm just here trying to process it. Uh, so I need a key. Oh, I need to kill the mole, no? Wait, what the heck? How did I get back here? Oh my gosh, I thought that was a wall. I thought the mushroom stem was a wall. <laughs> Whoops. That was that was not my best play. I, I apologize for that. Oh my gosh, throw the whole toad away, dude. Throw the whole toad away. All right, we're not going to get bamboozled this time. But I think if we want to kill the mole, I just use this guy, no? Yeah. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, thwomp. <laughs> Dude, that thwomp is gone. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna put this shellman on. Get out of here. I think I just cheesed it. I'm gonna be real with you guys. <laughs> I think I just cheesed this level. Oh gosh, wait. No. I want the shellman. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I didn't... I just got blocked by James. Oh my gosh. There we go. That, yeah, that Mole King is gone. <laughs> if you're wondering why it took me 10 minutes to do that, I kept messing up on the cheese. I really, really wanted to cheese it this way, and I just kept making silly mistakes. But yeah, there you go, Sailor Monty. <laughs> I have infiltrated the Monty hideaway. I took care of business, and it's time to move on. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, that happens. That happens. Thank you so much for sending that in. It was a fun level regardless. I like the aesthetics. I like the challenge. Really, really good level. A little bit of cheese there, but uh, that's okay. Let's keep going. 
All right, next up we have L-O-Z-A-L-T-T-P, Mothula's Revenge by C-Book Guy. Mothula reincarnated. Find 10 red coins, 2 checkpoint, optional find 3 50 coins. 48 clears, 320 attempts. All right. Oh, I like these kinds of levels that have like the maps in the top left corner. I think that's super, super, super cool. Okay, I'm guessing this is... I don't want to say like... Is this directly inspired or is this directly taken from Legend of Zelda? I ask that because I've never played Legend of Zelda. <laughs> I know. I feel like by now you, you guys should not be surprised with how uncultured I am. But yeah, I have, I have not played Legend of Zelda, any of them. So I don't know if this is a direct reference or if this is just like someone's interpretation of it, you know? So far, though, this is super creative. I will say that much. Incredibly, incredibly creative. Although, although, I think there's a little bit of cheese. Hang on. <laughs> little, little bit of cheese. I'll, I'll take that, though. Dude, I'm cheesing everybody's level today. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, what am I looking for here? Oh, jeez. I mean, I can do this. That's not what you're so. Oh! Oh, I know what to do. I I'm being silly. Sorry, guys. I'm being super quirky right now. What I have to do... ...is do that. There we go. And also, I, I see this. I see this little gap on the floor. I see it. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> There's one of the bonus rooms. Right? This is a bonus room, right? I don't think this is actually part of the exploration section. This is so cool! Also, I, I'm so sorry, I don't know who the Galoomba is supposed to represent. I, I apologize. It is not your fault that I am uncultured. Oh my gosh. Good thing we have a helmet. It is not your fault that I am uncultured. Okay, well... This actually should be enough for me to get in. There we go. Let's get rid of this one so it's not awkward going back and forth. Cool. Uh, so now I need a P-Switch. Probably in one of the adjacent rooms, I would imagine. Oh, yep, there it is. <laughs> I think this was expertly crafted so that I can't cheese it. Although, I think... Oh, that's not a softlock. I thought that was a softlock for a second, but it's not. Get... There we go. Oh, what the heck? All right, let's go, go, go. Let us go. Great. Anything up top? Uh, another pink coin, which I will take, but I think I have to... Sh I think this is a shooting gallery. Oh, wait, this one actually might be kind of hard to get. Never mind, I got it. All right, we're done with the bottom right quadrant of the, the dungeon. Now, I'm going to go towards the left-hand side. Oh, I see it. I see it. <laughs> I wonder if those were supposed to be like crates or something. That's what I... That's the first thing that came to my mind were crates. Okay, I'm just going to keep doing this. Until it hits. There we go. See? <laughs> it's got to keep on spamming. Great. How... I have an idea, but I don't think it's the correct one. It worked, though. It worked a little too nicely. Maybe that is what I was supposed to do. I see another secret dungeon there. There we go. Okay. We're almost done, actually. We're making really good progress. And we're finding all the bonus rooms. I don't know who the Galoomba is supposed to be. I'm so sorry. <laughs> now we can go down the main corridor. See what awaits us. Checkpoint. We'll take. Okay, I see what I have to do. This one can might be a little annoying. I don't mean that in a bad way. 
I just mean it in the fact that these whirlwind willies here can be a little bit annoying sometimes. <laughs> I mean, that that's that's good enough for me. That is good enough for me. I, I am not a big fan of the Whirlwind Willies. Oh, wait. Oh, got it. <laughs> that was pretty nice. To the left? I'm still missing one secret dungeon. Oh, hey. Don't do that. Stop. <laughs> there you go. Okay, that works. And now we have one more room. Oh, I forgot that there's a time limit in this game. I forgot that's a thing. Okay, well, we know where the last pink coin is. It has to be in this room. The lazy coin? <laughs> well, I'm glad I got the lazy coin last. Or did that say last coin? I don't know if that said lazy coin or last coin. It might have just said last coin. Oh my goodness, what the heck is this? Boom, boom, how you doing, buddy? Boom, boom. Boom, boom, get down here. Always causing a scene, honestly. Oh, this is not good. Oh, I mean, that, that was my fault, right? That, that, that was my fault, I got impatient. But I got, I got nervous. I thought I was gonna run out of time. Thank you. I think we're good now. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> oh, I missed one of the secret rooms. That's okay. You guys can go ahead and explore. That was a freaking amazing level. I'm not going to lie. I think the map is super cool. I've seen a few levels do that, and every single time I'm blown away by it. It's such a creative twist. All right, let's do like two more. But uh, before we do that, yeah, really, really incredible level. I'm sorry, I've never played Legend of Zelda. <laughs> that's that's on me. But yeah, amazing level. I loved all the dungeons. I can't stress how much I enjoyed this level. Thank you so much. All right, I think this video might be going on a little bit too long, so we're going to wrap it up with this level. Indiana Toad, Temple of Shroom. You lost today, kid, but that doesn't mean you have to like it. Six clears, 144 attempts, created by Devistic. Alright, so let's see what we have today. What's going on with Indiana Toad? A little bit of a tight jump, maybe? I should have crouched. That That's on me. There we go. See, that wasn't that bad. Oh my gosh, How? why can I not surf? I can't surf. Funnily enough, I, I actually can't surf IRL. I'm... I don't want to say I'm, like, afraid of the ocean, but I'm afraid of the ocean. So I kind of don't involve myself in any aquatic activities. <laughs> I'm actually a really bad swimmer as a result as well. So, yeah. Fun little fact about me while we progress through this. <gasps> what the heck?! <laughs> What the heck was that, buddy? Oh my gosh, I would be a terrible Indiana Jones, a terrible Nathan Drake, Lara Croft, whoever it may be. I, I would be terrible, apparently. Little bit, little bit oblivious. <laughs> this is cool. I like the auto scroll. It adds a, another layer to like the exploration fuel you're trying to go for. All right, I see this one though. I, I see this boulder. There we go. All right, we're going deep in the dungeon now. Oh, I think I'm supposed to race it. Okay. I got boned. No, we're not gonna get, oh my God. It's been a long time since I've been boned on this channel. I thought we were past this, but I guess not. All right, throw your stinking bone. Oh gosh, yeah, no, my momentum got chalked up there. There we go. Oh, we gotta go, we gotta go. I'm going too slow, I think. I feel like I'm going too slow. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. We made it. I didn't really get any treasure. I still 
Don't look at me like that, you stinking skull. I'm not the one that's trapped in the rock like you. You're gonna give me the side eye and everything. What the heck? Get out of here with those shenanigans. Is this my treasure? Might be. I mean, I can't complain. Honestly, I'm surprised that these raggedy old lifts are, you know, sustaining their... What am I trying to say? What am I saying? <laughs> I'm surprised that these lifts still work. That That's what I'm trying to say. GG. Hi, Mom. Hello. How's it going? Oh! You guys did not see what happened to that Yoshi. I, 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 don't, I don't even know what happened to that Yoshi. Wow, it's a open-ended mystery, isn't it? Well, let's just uh, get out of here. We have our life, and that is the most prized possession we can have. That was fun. That was a fun little level. I like the lore that went with it. Like, it definitely felt like I was spelunking and exploring this dungeon. Super, super creative level, Devastix. Thank you so much for sending that in. I appreciate it. Anyways, with that being said, I think that just about wraps up another Subscriber Sunday. I had a lot of fun with today's levels, and I hope you guys did as well. If your level did not get chosen, make sure to leave a comment down below, and I'll try to get to it next week. Uh, other than that, subscribe if you haven't. I will see you guys next time. Peace out, everybody.